Here's Mark. I'm sorry, uh, but I think we went to high school together. At the same time? Yeah, yeah. Your name is Mavis Gary? It's Mavis Gary Crane now. I'm Matt Freehoff. Uh, my locker is actually next to yours all through high school. Matt. Freehoff. Yeah. Yeah, your locker was right there. <clears throat> right next to mine. We didn't run the same circles. You were very popular, if I remember correctly. You won best hair. Did I? What did you win? I didn't. They uh, usually give out like 15 of those and only it's like the same five people. Yeah. Well, listen, Matt, it was really good to see you. I, what are you doing back in Mercury? You moved back or? Of course not. Gross. No, I, I live in Minneapolis. Ah. I'm just here for a little real estate thing. I own some property. Right. I read in the Sun that you are a writer. Yes, I am an author. <laughs> Children's books. Why? That's industry speak for a young adult. It's a really popular teen series. It's everywhere. It's huge. You've probably seen it. Yeah, um, with the vampires. And... <laughs> Whoa. Take that, liver. Aren't you that hate crime guy? Excuse me? You totally are. You're the hate crime guy. <sighs> oh my god, why didn't you just say that? Now I know who you are. You're Matt, the hate crime guy. Yes, Mavis, when I was a senior, when we were seniors, a bunch of jocks who thought I was gay jumped me in the woods. That's right. And uh, hit me in the legs and dick with a crowbar. With a crowbar. I totally remember that. Well, it was national news. I mean, uh, until people found out I wasn't really gay and though it wasn't a hate crime anymore. It was just a fat guy getting his ass beat. Didn't you get to miss like, a bunch of school? Yeah, I got to miss about six months. It was awesome. Fuck. How's your dick? <laughs> not good. <laughs> not, not good. Does it work? Yeah, oh yeah, it works. Works. You know, it just kind of, you know... It's, <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Hard jacks. Do you know Jinxies? I don't. Buddy Slade. Buddy <laughs> Slade. That is an interesting fact. Mm -hmm. Come here. You want to know why I'm really in town? Yes. I can't tell you in here. <clears throat> Okay, you got me out here. All right, here's the deal. Buddy Slade and I are meant to be together. I'm here to get him back. Buddy Slade, all right. I'm pretty sure he's married with a kid on the way, though. No, kid's here. She had it already. I'm, I'm cool with it. Look, I've got baggage, too. <laughs> <laughs> so what? You're not joking? Oh my god, Matt. I get it. I get it. People won't understand. Okay? But these things happen. Like, in real life, they actually happen. They just tend to happen in slow motion, you know? They get divorced. They reconfigure. And society's, like, fine with that, you know? If you take your time. Like, an emotional glacier. I'm 27, Matt. Mavis, I would keep all this to yourself, all right? I would, I would, I would find a therapist, you know, talk to a professional. <laughs> Matt. Oh, boy. You don't get it. You don't. Love conquers all. <sighs> Have you not seen The Graduate? Or, like, I don't know, anything. <gasps> a taxi. Yes, uh, we <clears throat> called it. Mavis, Mavis, hey, uh, Buddy Slade has a life, so... <laughs> Buddy's late as a No, he has a baby, and babies are boring. 